your months, another tip that you want to remember is uh, antifreeze. We use antifreeze in our cars. We top it up, refill it, spill it, or we have leaks. So you want to make sure that you're using pet-friendly antifreeze. And um, there are many on the market. One way to find out which ones they are is go to spca.bc.ca and look for those pet-friendly antifreeze. Because if, if the cats get into them or the dogs, if they're out there, especially if you've got your neighborhood cats, they're coming um, to, to, to drink, uh, tastes maybe a little bit sweet, they might drink it and it can actually uh, kill them. So you want to make sure you're using pet-friendly antifreeze. So one thing you want to do is if you think that your pet has gotten into antifreeze, whether it's a, a cat or a dog, no matter what, contact your vet right away just to make sure um, they're looked at and you can take those uh, safety precautions right away, get them treated.